Fireball Cinnamon Whiskey. Is it worth it? Check out the whiskey whistle. Hey peeps, Mark here from Whiskey Whistle on YouTube sharing a little whiskey awesomeness from Winnipeg, the center of North America, bringing you Fireball Cinnamon Whiskey. Now there's much debate about whether or not this is whiskey because whiskey is whiskey and when you change it, when you add other flavors to it, it's no longer whiskey. But you know, this is actually from um, USA and for whatever reason, they have been able to use the term just simply cinnamon whiskey. Here in Canada, you'll see apple flavored whiskey or vanilla flavored whiskey. You will not see simply vanilla whiskey or apple whiskey because these things technically don't exist. But I'm not here to debate that. What I'm here to do is to tell you whether or not this is worthwhile for you as a whiskey lover to go out and buy. This is a 50 milliliter little bottle, Fireball Red Hot Cinnamon Whiskey. It's 33% alcohol. It's low in alcohol for whiskey. 66 proof. Whiskey with natural cinnamon flavor, it says. I'm sure there's sugar added to it. Their tagline is Ignite the Night. So should we ignite the night? Let's check that out. And we're going to go all in with this. It smells like... It smells like a combination of cinnamon hearts and something kind of like just straight hotness, like Tabasco. In she goes. So if you ever wondered how much 50 milliliters was, well, that's, that's it. There you go. All right, so we're going to ignite the night here on Whiskey Whistle with a little fireball it doesn't want to stand up it would be nice if that were glass but then it would be much more expensive wouldn't it all right so here in whiskey whistle we're going to check out the color of the whiskey yep even this one we'll check out the legs of the whiskey yes even this one fireball then we'll check out the nose the palate and the finish and then i'm going to shoot this stuff and see if i actually survive uh to, to tell about it okay all right so the color first of all as you can see, we've got pretty much adulterated orange glow happening there. Now, if that's bourbon as the base, in fact, I didn't read about it, so I don't even know. Um, I'm guessing it's probably bourbon as a base. If it is source types of whiskey, or if that's corn whiskey, in fact, American corn whiskey, this likely has some color added. And the legs, again, as this has a lot of sugar in it, I believe, it should have some very juicy, slow legs. So let's check those out. The fireball legs. It is coming down in a crisscross pattern. Isn't that weird? Can you see that, what I'm seeing? Um, so a legless whiskey. A legless, actually it's not a whiskey. This is a legless non-whiskey purporting itself to be a whiskey using local laws that were probably created uh, to facilitate charades like this. Oh, okay. Now, oh, there we now we. Oh shit! Oh shit! Well, there went my fireball. <sighs> All right. Well, let's just carry on. I've got a little bit left there, so we'll see how that is. I uh, won't be able to shoot that, but yep, very very sticky legs. So let's see how it is. <laughs> what the hell is this? What? If you're a whiskey lover, just, just don't buy this. If you want to have fun with your friends and get drunk, then 
this is what you need. And will it ignite your night? <coughs> I think I think you're gonna go home in a body bag. All right, uh, whiskey whistle. Out, out, out. <laughs>